Hi there, today we're looking at the function f of x equals tan x, and this is an interesting function in that we calculate it by dividing sine x over cos x. As you can see, when cos x would be equal to zero, our function does not exist and we get a vertical asymptote. Like all functions, we can transform this parent function through a variety of mechanisms. If a is less than zero, this will vertically reflect our function over the x-axis. If the absolute value of a is between 0 and 1, this will vertically compress our function, whereas if the absolute value of a is greater than 1, this will vertically stretch our function. If d is less than 0, this will shift our function down d units, whereas if d is greater than 0, this will shift our function up d units. If c is less than 0, this will shift our function right c units, whereas if c is greater than 0, this will shift our function left c units. If b is less than 0, this will reflect our function over the y-axis. If the absolute value of b is between 0 and 1, this will horizontally stretch our function, whereas if the absolute value of b is greater than 1, this will horizontally compress our function.